Welcome one and all, I'm Decoy. Oh, and it's time for 76 verses. And what are we doing today? Well, of course we got our PlayStation copy of 76. Uh, destined for destruction. And, if you watched last week's video, uh, 76 versus Crossbow, you know this time, well, and you know from the thumbnail, that it's paintballs. Now, why do I have this board? Because we have more than one kind of paintball uh, that we're going to be shooting at it. So first up, regular paintball. All right, nothing, nothing fancy. See that? Kind of bounces. We weren't really sure if uh, if that's going to do the trick. So I got these. Now this was advertised as a self-defense riot paintball. Yeah. Big difference. So yeah, this one, super hard. I, yeah, there's no smashing that. It is, it feels about the same weight as a paintball. So, you know, I expect great things from that if the paintball falls short. Now, just like with the Xbox copies, I will be giving away the code inside of these. So stay tuned, and I will hook you up with the PlayStation code in a little bit. But I really want to get out there and, and you know, just, you know, let loose with a little mayhem. So I will see you in a bit. Oh man, look at that. Like we were gonna hit this look with at that. We were gonna hit it with the riot, but yeah, there... I guess we didn't need to. <laughs> wow. That is cool. All right, um, well, that was, that was a bit surprising. I did not think the paintball was going to be that effective, and, wow, I underestimated that. I mean, who would have thought that this little dude would make a copy just kind of explode? That was really cool, and my table's kind of uneven or something. Yeah, paintball's having none of that. Bye, paintball. Now, this thing... Well, cool. I mean, we really didn't get to use it to its full potential. Um, so we might have to think of something awesome to do with these, because I've got a bunch of them. But either way, now let's get to the good part. The code for PlayStation, the Tricentennial Edition. There you go. Man, it's so weird looking at PlayStation codes, how short they are in comparison to the Xbox codes. And, yeah, so if you're wondering, PlayStation people, why you're getting Tricentennial, but Xbox got an Atom code, that's, that's just what came in the games. All right. But, I, I do have more copies on the way of Tricentennial Editions for both sides. 
So, stay tuned. We still have a lot of these to go through. I mean, hey, if you got a cool idea of how to destroy one of these, let me know. I've got a few things in the works already. That's kind of a toss-up as to what's next, but either way, I'm going to leave it here. I hope you enjoyed it. Please remember to like, sub, and share. Later.